Hi there, I'm Shelley. I'm Seth. And today we're going to show you how we made this hidden bed. To start the project, Sepp has cut out these panels for the sides. They've got the bit that's cut out for the step to go on to. Then he's attached these strips along here. This is at the height of here so that we can put beams on it. So beams can go on and then it's level at the top. And on the back, if I just turn it round, there we go. He's added some strips of wood along here and here. This is just so that it goes over the back of the skirting board and fit snug with the wall. Once we've put the side panels into position, we're then going to use square timber or beams to create a framework. Our framework is 240 long and because the bed's only going to be two meters long we're going to put in a framework over here because we don't need this space and we need to put this little step in here this will be extra and will be fixed to the floor the other step actually pulls out with the bed you could actually build like a hideaway in there for your pillows and your blankets but we don't need that because we've got a house where we store everything so we're not going to do that, but in a studio, you could actually use this space as storage. Now it's time to make the frame for the drawer that's in the bed. Sepp's made a piece of wood here and over here. And this is the bit that's going at the front. This is going to be the step. This will pull up in front of it and be a step like the little step over there. And first of all, we've got to drill holes and attach these wheels to the side panels. And in here, also the wheels are attached in here. We're going to build the step together and then we're going to create the bed box around it.
This is a bed bracket that we're going to use on the back part of the box and it just pulls off like this and I'll show you where to attach these two pieces. We're now ready to place the slatted bed frame in the framework of the bed and we're going to screw it into position. If you want to see how to build this slatted frame together because it was a building kit then we'll show you that next week so don't forget to take a look at next week's film that's all about slatted bed frames. The slatted bed frame is now fixed in position and now we can slide the drawer underneath the bed frame and so that it glides a little bit better we're going to add some of these rolls over this side there's a piece of wood inside here and we're just going to screw these on in here I'll show you that in a minute you can't see it very well at the moment when that's done we're going to place the lid on and going to make the clap that goes down on here a piece of wood and then of course we're going to finish the step off and then we should be nearly finished. So our bed's nearly finished now. All we've got to add is a headboard that Sepp's already made. It's just simply a piece of wood that we're just going to slot in at the back of the mattress so that the pillars don't fall on the floor. And then this headboard can be took off again when you want to store the bed, place on top of the bed, and then the whole lot just push on, pushes underneath. So we hope you liked our video. We'll see you in a couple of weeks time. Don't forget to like and subscribe and ciao ciao.